Haha, <laughs> got you that time, Robotnik. But we're still not done yet. Welcome to the Doomsday Zone. Alright, let's collect us some rings. Now you only have access to this zone if you get all of the Chaos Emeralds. Love the music for this part as well. For this part, just try to dodge the asteroids as best as you can, and collect as many rings as you can. Every time you're hit by the, uh, 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 one of those missiles, you get sent flying back as well. Don't forget, while you're flying around here, you have a speed-up option by pressing the A button to make Dit and Sonic do a dash. Now what we need to do here is lure Robotnik's missiles into hitting him in the face. Which is easier said than done. Okay, good. We did that with at least 50 rings. Because he's still not giving up now. How many robots did he have prepared for this? Right, we need to chase after him with the dash button, otherwise we're going to keep lagging behind. There's one hit. Be careful not to fly into his flame jets either. Otherwise, you will get sent flying back again. Come on. And you're out of there. Dr. Robotnik slash Dr. Eggman, you're done for. And the Master Emerald is now safely in our possession. Whew. So that part can actually be really difficult if you forget the fact that Sonic can still dash while he's flying through space there. A lot of times in the past I've just tried to catch up to him by flying to the right, and it was tough. I'm not, I'm not sure if I was actually able to beat him that way without the dash. Anyway, there you have it folks. Welcome to the full true ending of Sonic, of Sonic 3 and Knuckles together. Now we can return return the Master Emerald to once to where it rightfully belongs on Angel Island. And it's now rising into the sky again. Now that the Master Emerald Emerald is back in place. There you go, Knuckles. Try not to get duped again by Robotnik. So I'm sure you will. Alright, there you have it, folks. That is the end of the full Sonic 3 and Knuckles experience. Oh boy. It, it was a lot of fun playing this game again. I had a lot more fun than playing through Sonic the Hedgehog 1 and 2, that's for sure. Yeah, honestly, Sonic 3 and... Sonic the Hedgehog 3 and Knuckles is just... They're masterpieces. They couldn't have got these games more perfect than they did. I just wish they would make more games like this. I mean, I know they made Sonic Mania, which I haven't actually played myself, but I heard it's, like, really good and, like, really true to, like, classic Sonic before he made the transition to 3D. So, um, I need to play Sonic Mania. I heard that's a really good game. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and shut up, and I'll go ahead and let the credits roll. I'll see you at the finale.
presented by Sega. And there you have it. The end of Sonic the Hedgehog 3 and Knuckles. And yep, that was the full ending. With all the Chaos Emeralds and Super Emeralds acquired. Alright guys, so this isn't going to be quite the end of Sonic 3 and Knuckles. Oh, that's pretty cool. Now we can go to whatever zone we want. But um, now that Sonic and Tails' ver uh, ver uh, story is pretty much complete, what I'm going to be doing next is we're going to be taking on Knuckles. Now, I'm not going to be playing as Tails alone because there's not really much point. I think he gets a super form if you manage to get all the Chaos Emeralds and Super Emeralds. But it doesn't seem really worth it, and I think it's the story's pretty much the same as Sonic's. I mean, maybe one day I'll do it, but... Yeah, so we're not quite done with this game yet, so when you guys join me next time, we'll be going back to... So we'll be going back to Sonic 3 and starting Knuckles' story. So, I'll see you then, guys.